Hello everyone, today I have with me the Samsung Galaxy J3 2016 so today I'll be showing you how to root this device I have currently the Samsung Galaxy J3 Exynos model Samsung Exynos processor now there are two um, processors the Qualcomm and Exynos so this one is the Exynos based model and it is running Android 7.1 Nougat so I'll be showing you how to root this one um, I did this video because I noticed that there is like it's very difficult to find a thread um, that shows how to root this device which is running Android 7.1 and also according to my research on um, Chainfire's auto root site the only root package for this device is for Android 6.0 so it won't work for Android 7.1 or 7.0 so I tried it and it didn't work and also TWERP is not available for this model my model is J320W8 so I found a way around that I downloaded a TWERP package for the Samsung Galaxy on 5 which has the same processor as my J3 here so it works um, but there is a problem though the problem is it doesn't touch the touch uh, feedback it doesn't work so what you have to do because you see the reason is because it is for the on 5 but the reason that it it stalled on the J3 is because the J3 and the ON5 have the same processors. So you see this here is called an OTG cable. So since top is not touching, we'll be using a mouse. So you see I connect it here. And I connect my mouse here. And then, and then we install it. Now anyway, I apologize for all that speaking, but you know, I wanted to explain everything before we begin. Now, for some of you, this will not be required because for the J320YZ model, which is a Qualcomm model, TWOP is available for you, so you can get it from there and install, and you do not need OTG. But for the Exynos model, which has Android 7.1, it will be required. Now, this video might be prolonged today because um, I spend most of my time speaking and I apologize for that but if you are really advanced and you know what to do then you can go ahead and skip at to whatever point that you want so first things first let me put in my password and turn on develop options so you go over to settings um, all right let's just wait for that go over to settings go down to developer options sorry let me just show you how to enable that first so go to settings about device system information and the build number tap on that multiple times until it enables developer options so now you'd see it appearing over there you go on to it turn it on you may get this message just tap ok and tap on oem unlocking to unlock your bootloader now if you do not do this then you may get a message saying that the flash of whatever custom boot image or recovery that you're installing on Audit, it will be blocked by the bootloader or it will say, give you a message saying uh, custom binary blocked by FRP. So you wouldn't want that, so just unlock your bootloader. Now, let's quickly power off. Oh, um, one more thing before we start, just ensure that you have super su downloaded onto the device the super su package the super su zip file so let me show you quick okay so just make sure, make sure that you have this file copied to the device so i will have all the required files for both models um, added but i did this video specifically for 107.0 anyway let's power off and reboot into download mode so you just power off your device and press volume down power and home buttons all together into 
download mode so you see right now i'm in download mode okay so the right now since i'm in download mode you'd like to open samsung odin uh, i will have the links all links in the description this since we're on this page now um, let's press volume up to continue and now connect your device and this should turn blue to show that the device is connected now one more thing please make sure this is very important please make sure that you uncheck auto reboot this is very important for those of you running android 7.1 okay now click on ap and locate the package so in my case i have it in the desktop in this folder here all right and now click start so just okay now it won't restart the device was powered off so now disconnect remove your battery replace your battery and of course cover and now power to reboot into top recovery you press your power you press your power home and volume up sorry about that mistake so now you release and it should reboot into top So you notice this uh, screen, remember I said that the package, the top recovery package was for the Galaxy J, sorry, the Galaxy On 5. So it wasn't for this model, so you notice touch isn't working. That's the reason we will be using the mouse. So you connect your OTG cable, connect your mouse. So guys, really today I apologize, but you know, I want to ensure that uh, everyone gets root access for this device so I apologize again I know some of you may not have it but it's very very simple very easy to get um, so now I'm going to just increase my brightness real quick okay so now in top let's get started let's get to the real things now so click so you remember I have my mouse here so you see touch isn't working so now go to install and scroll all the way down and then you will see here uh, super so so select this and swipe to flash now this will take some time i won't record the entire process because i've already prolonged the video and yes you will notice some flickering on the screen please don't worry about that that's just because this top isn't for this device like i i said at first but i want to reiterate that this top is for the Galaxy On 5 which has the same processor as this J3 that I have here. I know I'm getting very technical but I apologize, just explaining. Um, so yeah, just don't worry about the flickering. Okay, so now it's complete. Let's reboot system. Uh, you might get this message here asking if you like it, just do not install. Now we're done with the OTG cable, so go ahead and disconnect. Also set the laptop aside too because no longer in use. Okay, so I will record the boot up process because um, I want to ensure that everything goes by well. So you see that device just powered off. Um, that's maybe a random reboot but this time it should boot up okay so hopefully this time it should boot up there should be no issues let's just give it some time <clears throat> almost there okay it's done uh, you can tell because my screen just dimmed a bit okay so now I am here on my home screen let me connect my charger because my battery is quite low okay so now I'm going to swipe up put in my password Mm, 
me just allow those apps to populate themselves okay so going on you see super su over here so that means i have super su installed the device is rooted now i also downloaded a root checker so if you do not have one i recommend you download one because um, if you'd like to ensure that the device is rooted then you can download it so you go on to root check now right now it is just checking the system to ensure that it has root and then you will get a prompt asking you to allow so now grant okay and now you see your samsung galaxy j36 2016 is rooted okay so now guys i will stop here for today that's it for me i hoped i helped you out of course and i really apologize for all the extended speaking in this video um, but anyway i hope i helped if i helped you of course comment share the video with others like it and most important of all, subscribe to my channel for more content. I'll see you in another video. Okay, so everyone, it's very important that I say um, you visit my website. I have a website on there. So you visit my website, either you go onto my channel's page and then you go to about or you check in the description. Visit my website. I have a lot of um, helpful stuff on there. You can download the different files because all the files that I feature on my channel, I have them listed on my website so you can go on there and download them um, also i have a live chat feature so if you'd like to chat with me um, concerning whatever issues you experienced on my videos you can also meet, reach me over there or also you can find my contact number there and also my email so yes so thank you very much for watching and i will see you in another video and remember, subscribe to Pops Reduction Stick.